Impassioned by a garble sunrise, Glasgow greets the world. Fully formed, streets of perfect symmetry invoke a higher power, erstwhile civic omnipotence. The city crashes into motion, pumped full of population and intravenous injection of humanity. While in the West, young mothers and absent fathers besiege the dear green places with earnest exercise and frivolous gossip. The remnants of the shipyards lay exposed. Titans acquiesce to atrophy. A history of rust has colonised the powerhouses of the Clyde once the envy of the world. Tourists grunt and groan over a bridge of sighs to hell, pockmarked with graves, while in the distance stands two cathedrals, worshipped with a fervour no god could match, while John Knox looks down his nose at the dead. By this river we flourish, in these streets we find courage, gold amongst the grit and the glamour, this contradicting reality, our beautiful duality, city of the pen and the hammer. Drum chapel and bears den sit side by side, poster boys for modern inequality, a living case study, just a street and 22 years of life expectancy between them. George Square sits resplendent in the rain, where the tanks once rolled to turn guns on their own. Red Clyde side threatened to turn scarlet as the workers stood unbent in Bolshevist flirtation. Merchant city four by fours shop for blood. The new bourgeoisie gentrifying all they see with media fuel, disposable income and dreams of being everything their parents were not. Nomad artists head south fleeing West End rent hikes and student encroachment, occupy ragged bar stools beside luminous jackets and the whimpering ghosts of professional drinkers reduced to speaking in tongues. The new towns creak under the weight of broken promises of regeneration. Artificial settlements abandoned, architectural brutalism besieged by retail parks and outlet stores, the exactitude of corporate living. While well, in a bleak council dwelling, chilled by an eastern wind, a lady of a certain age gathers china and porcelain hands and curses her late husband with a loving nod, with a wry smile. By this river we flourish, in these streets we find courage, gold amongst the grit and the glamour, this contradicting reality, our beautiful duality, city of the pen and the hammer.